Hello there, welcome to Strum, the show dedicated to and all about the wonderful instrument that is the acoustic guitar. Now here in the studio with me today is Ray Cheong. Now over the years, Ray has been carving himself a solid reputation as one of the local scene's young rising stars. Now not only does he perform tons of shows, he also organizes them. Who can forget his unforgettable manga sessions a few years back? Speaking of a few years back, Ray, he actually self-funded himself a trip to the UK playing tons of shows in London as well as on the continent. Uh, 70 shows to be precise. Hello, Ray. Welcome to the show. Thank you so much, Zach. All right, mate. Well, you're a pretty handy finger star guitar player as well. We'll be talking to you at length about that. Yes. But I want to start at the beginning, mate. When did you first start playing the guitar? I started playing the guitar uh, when I was uh, 17. Between 16 and 17. Wow, that's pretty late. <coughs> huh? Yeah, I saw my friend uh, play uh, the song, uh, rock song Creed, <laughs> higher, on acoustic guitar. And I thought, how could acoustic guitar play a song that's an electric? I have no idea that, you know, that acoustic can actually play the same thing electric plays. Y yeah. And it got me really inspired and I just took it on from then on. Yeah. Okay, fantastic stuff. So, you know, a lot of people, you know, they teach themselves to go to classes. What was it for you? I mean, did you, I mean, you're a pretty skilled guitar player. How hard was it to get to your standard of uh, I think skill? Um, I pretty much 90% self-taught. Maybe I, I tried class once, but mm -hmm. it didn't work because I realized that uh, I learned more myself than going to class. Yeah. And uh, I did everything online. And mm -hmm. so I think everybody else can do it as well. Online, right now, it's much easier to find <laughs> sources to learn than last time. Yeah. But yeah, pretty much online, the World Wide Web taught me how to play the guitar. Fantastic <laughs> stuff. Musicians today are so yes. lucky. Okay, mate, what's your relationship with the guitar like now? I mean, we've had people on the show mm. and everyone's got a different uh, way of describing their relationship with the guitar. What's yours like, mate? I think um, my relationship with the guitar throughout playing 10 years, right? Mm. Um, switching between acoustic and electric. Right now, I'm. Uh, this this is uh, the piece. This is the masterpiece that um, I'm using for mm. my shows. Mm. And the importance of uh, an instrument for your performance for your show is so is massive, you know, mm -hmm. because the sound that your instrument produces is gonna be your sound. Mm -hmm. And that um, if you use anything less, you mm. might you might confuse the audience of what to expect from you. Yeah. You have to somehow invest in a certain sound mm. after you acquire a certain skill mm -hmm. and deliver it to get the best for the audience so that they can remember you as that is a sound that is this guy's sound mm -hmm. this guy uses this stuff mm. to produce this well that's on the professional level but what on the Sorry, personal yeah. level uh. you know because it always begins with a very personal thing right strumming acoustic guitar yeah. i mean it's it, it's 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 an incredible personal thing i think personally the acoustic guitar has brought me into levels that i never thought or expect I would be today mm. because I always thought that the acoustic guitar was just the mellow. It's, it's always has always been the mellow, the one people thought that if you're playing acoustic, it's gonna be like, all right, we're gonna strum away. But no, the acoustic guitar right now, as we all know on YouTube, we watch people like Andy McKee. There are so many different type of new age guitar playing and that there are more and more cover songs, metal cover songs, jazz cover songs, everything done in acoustic format simply to show that the acoustics actually like the grand piano is the most basic form of strings, mm. strings, six strings and the fingers mm. and that's it. But you yet know? it's so versatile. Right? Yes, yeah. yes, there are a lot of sounds you can make from the from the acoustic guitar mm. and throughout the years I think I've, I'm still learning and are discovering more and more of the acoustic guitar and never stop. Okay. Yeah. Well, it's an endless journey, that one. Yeah. I'll tell you what, you play finger style, right? I mean, which is quite amazing. I've just seen you play and it's quite mind blowing. So, mate, what is the attraction uh, to this finger style? Uh, the style that I do, I think many people play, play finger style and that um, they, are, they are a slight different in uh, styles of finger styles, you mm -hmm. know, traditional finger style versus a new age tapping slash slapping finger style. Right. It's a, just a new way of playing the guitar. Imagine mm. playing the banjo or mm. playing uh, mm. the sitar where the whole instrument is already tuned to a certain tuning. Mm -hmm. And that when I play uh, my uh, uh, songs in uh, different tunings, you know, mm. it is mm. actually, it's actually, 
it, the whole guitar becomes a different instrument by itself. Yeah, it's very percussive as well. Yes, right? ah, yeah. yes, I not forgetting I've used a lot of percussive elements yeah, to get yeah, that fantastic. to get a, a solo piece full. Okay. Yeah. Well, you know, there's so much you can do with the acoustic guitar, and that's what this show is all about. Strum. Well, Ray, it's been a pleasure having you on Thank Strum. You. Long live the acoustic guitar. Mate, before you go, you're going to play us a song, right? So yes. what are you going to play for us? We're gonna, I'm going to play uh, slapping, using slapping and tapping technique, this song uh, called Pangdi Fight and also Knock on Wood. Okay, two originals? Uh, no, this is actually a, a rendition, my own rendition of uh, a cover song by Justin King, whom one of the most talented fellas ever, and you can find him out, Justin King. Okay. Yep, and yep. Fantastic stuff. Well, you've been watching Strong. Until next time, enjoy your music. Rachel. There's nothing you want from me. There's nothing that I can give you. So much pain, yeah, we talk about everything. Though I know that you would set me free. You would set me free. Oh, so afraid to let you in. I'm so afraid of your pain. I'm so afraid of how I feel. So afraid you will see suffering within. So afraid to let you in. I'm so afraid of your pain. Suffering within So afraid to let you go.